everyone, this is Farouk here. Today we are going to talk about the Raspi communication with NRF24 and I'm going to write the code. I just wrote the code in the Arduino ID and I'm going to explain the code and I'm going to show the connection. So let's get started. So this is for transmitter and this is for receiver. I just use uh, two Raspi Pico. Uh, one of them I just connect potentiometer and one of them is the servo motor so this is for C the RF24 radio you have to write CE pin and CSM pin so if you are using Raspi Pico and you wanna write code on Arduino either you have to connect like this. This is the default pins for Raspi for Pico uh, under the uh, SPI communication. As you can see in here also, you have to connect like this. If you don't connect like this, it's not gonna work. So you have to make sure make sure that the connection will be like that. And this is the pin out. So, CS connect on to GPIO 17. So that's why we connect there. Is we just wrote there 17. So you can connect CE pin whatever you want. Just like GPIO pin. I just connect to both of them 22. And for communication, you have to write address. I just wrote this address. You can change it if you want. It's up to you. So other code is like that, like just like reading the potentiometer value and is that also like for servo motor we we have to change the analog from zero to one thousand three to zero to one eighty for servo motor and it's kind of delay when you upload the code if you don't want to del delay you can just delete this code code wise i just put that for just to check and as i said before you have to don't forget to connect like this uh, that's it and this is the co pin out for you don't need to connect the uh, irq just connect the other seven then VCC is 3.3 .3 volt. Don't forget, don't don't connect to the uh, 5 volt. That's it. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.